under the trailer. Figures, right? Oh. Well. I put it in the big box for now. Yeah. And I may put it back. In. It doesn't take up any room. Right. That way we'll have one with us. When okay. Travel. Okay, travel. Oh, there's a bird on the roof. Hi, buddy. You're sitting on my solar panel bird. So I watch the clothes back Be careful up there. Hey Fatima. Fatima, that paint and sip is indeed tonight. Yeah, I'm going. You want me to live stream it? Hey Terry. Can't get wet. I can't get my hand wet. Otherwise, I would help him out. I don't have a problem with it. They don't have a problem with it, I should say. At least you can see the what the antenna looks like. <laughs> it's an antenna. Hey, Rob. I'm sorry, Rob. I can't get my hand wet. No, Phantom, it's fine. They, they allowed it. The picture that they picked is interesting. It's a picture of a camper with two trees next to it. It says Happy Camper on top. So it might be a bit of a challenge, but...
<laughs> they want to know if this is the right channel for the wet gym contest. Huh? They want to know if this is the right channel for the wet gym contest. <laughs> Right, Fatima? I don't know if this is the right channel for Jim not screwing up the solar panel. Well, don't screw up the solar panel. That would be bad. Just don't be a bear on it. Rob said you missed a spot. <laughs> Totally, because I'm not getting up there. <laughs> Daddy doesn't have any ones on. <laughs> I'm just, it's not a race, so. I finally found a use for this hold, this uh, kayak this rack. Yeah, it holds the hose nice. <laughs> it holds the hose nice. <laughs> What is up? What else is up there that we didn't know about? Huh? I said, what else is up there that we didn't know about? Oh, okay. Tens and twenties. <laughs> Hundreds, too, if you got them. Yeah, you didn't know he washed campers, did you? See? Things you don't know. Absolutely not. Nope, not up here. Thank God, that would kind of be a bad thing. Like, uh, we have to move a bird's nest. What? Oh, my toes are getting wet. Franklin turned down the picture. <laughs> You're funny, Terry. <clears throat> it's a beautiful day in Jersey. It's going to be 96 today. Hey, Ben. Yeah. Can you go open the awning up? 
Three inches. Okay. I have to open the awning. Okay. Three inches. Okay. I can do that. You know why I can do that? Because I can. I know. I know how to push the button. I, I know how to push the button. Oh, let's see. That's exactly right. Exactly right. Three inches. Wait till I get out. Hold on. <laughs> Well, what the heck, Terry? It's not our fault. We've been here. Hello. <laughs> Dirty bird. Dirty bird, dirty bird. Damn, all that stuff was up in there? Yeah. Wow. Some of it, not much. Some of it came off the roof. But I'm watching it. I just saw this big clump of leaves come out. Bro, you never stop. You're like constantly running. Ha! <laughs> There's a piece of something stuck right there. Hmm. Totally found me. Yeah, what happened with that, Bree? I saw the picture that you sent me. Jim. <laughs> Jim just worked. <laughs> Bree's calling you Twerky Jim. Huh? Bree is calling you Twerky Jim. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, just a leak in a hose, okay. So you overheated almost, pretty much. And it doesn't take long.
smike from the motot. Okay, I got it. Smoke from the motor. Smike from the motot. That must be Bree language. <laughs> smike from the motot. <laughs> <laughs> the Mutat must be a new engine part for a car. Yes. You only get smike from the Mutat. Well, at least we know the kayak rack comes in handy for something. It's a regular hose. We have a, a double connection on the water spigot, so the water hose for the camper goes on one side, and then we put that on the other side. One thing I can't complain about, we definitely have good water pressure here. Yep, no kayak. Bree needs more coffee, not looking forward to work. Well, you know. That's always a thing, Bree. No. Yeah. <laughs> that would be bad. I have a question. What? You got up there with the bucket and brush. How the hell are you going to get back down again? Same way. Oh. Did you walk around the back of the trailer? Yeah. You see the other ladder? Yeah. So I'm going to take the bucket and brush and put it on the edge, step it down, and then step the slope down onto the other ladder and get off. Okay. If you didn't think I could get up here without having any idea how you get down here. No, but, you know, I just got to think about these things. Helicopter rescue. Helicopter rescue. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. <laughs> What, what's going on here? We have a traffic jam.
That that's that could work, but it'd be tough if you landed on the hitch or something. The roof must be really dirty. He's been up there for like 22 minutes. 20 minutes. Hey, Bernie. What's going on? Yeah, we don't need any broken bones. That would be bad. And, and to continue from last night's conversation, Bernie, this is all part of the maintenance. Making sure it's clean, nothing gets blocked up, stuff like that. No, I'm alright with it. I mean, we have uh, um, a wheat distribution hitch and sway bars, a sway bar that goes on it, just to tighten everything up so we don't lose the trailer. Um, and I've done it before, but with my hand and stuff all jacked up, I can't do it at the moment. But I've done it. It's not a big deal once you get used to it. The first time's a little tricky, but once you get the hang of it, it's alright. Fatima, this is your roof. You should be maintaining your roof, Fatima. I mean, you claimed it. <laughs> yeah, I, I like the fact that you can just, like, unhitch and just drive your car wherever you want to go instead of having to worry about unhooking and driving somewhere and you hope you fit and this and that and Bree, stop being naked. Just put clothes on. Bree's naked, everybody. Close your eyes, please. I mean, you can you can tow your car behind a motorhome, but it's just like extra weight you're pulling.
Oh, okay, fine. Okay, just make sure. Did you do the blow dry? <laughs> Fatima says she's going to give you a pair of wings in case you just want to float down. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> he said call his guardian angel when he goes to get down. Just don't slip. Who the hell would wear wheelies in the campground? You can't heely in the campground. Like, you're gonna fall and bust your butt. You want me to get Bruce or something? No. Okay. He's not going to catch me if I fall. <laughs> well, I'm sure as, I sure as hell can't, but he might be able to. He's bigger than you are. Keep going. Good. One more. Then you can step on the ladder. This is very light and small, so Okay. <sighs> Okay, I think he's safe. Whew. Everybody can stop biting their fingernails.
Everybody can breathe now. Yep, you can breathe. It was, right? He was up there for like a half an hour. You need more soap? Okay. Look, our soap is neon pink. How cool is that? Neon pink soap. <laughs> Here's some pink soap for you, Bruce. It's pink. I think you need some pink soap. <laughs> Let's have a seat for a second here. Oh, God. Ugh. Dirty bird. She's a dirty bird. That's where we hook up our griddle at. Underneath there where that arrow is. There's a propane connection right there. Oh, we wanted to check, put air in the tires. Because next week I can't do anything because I'm working. I think that's what it was. I said there were two things I wanted to do. Wash the camper. And I think the other one was put air in the tires. Pretty sure that's what it was. I'm pretty sure that's done there what it was. Yeah. Oh, I guess I shouldn't sit here. Hey, are you late with K and D? What's going on? We're just watching the camper. We've just like got off the roof. We've been on the roof for half an hour. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. I couldn't remember. We were trying to figure it out last night, got him and it was like, it was wash the camper and check the tires. I think that's what it was. Actually, I think all the tires are good because you're supposed to be within three pounds of 50, and the lowest you have is 47. No, 45. 45? Yeah. 
Didn't I say I wasn't going to buy another white camper? <laughs> I, I vaguely remember saying that. Yeah, well, it is, you know, and, and you know, and my life, both Ruth's and Jim were both, I like it. So what did I do? I bought it, you know. Um, I'll show you. Ugh. I will show you the soap we're using. It's got a, it's a wash and wax and one. And it's really, really soapy. Nothing off, you know, nothing exciting. It's just this stuff right here. That's it. Nothing exciting. Don't drink it. <laughs> Don't drink it. doesn't taste good. Puts a whole new meaning of, you know, washing your mouth out with soap. <sighs> Majority while with green detail, that's right. So, You're welcome. When I get done with this shop, yes. I have people go inside and find some sort of a perfect cleaner to spray them. Yeah, somebody would become a human bubble machine if they drink any of that. It is super soap. What's that? The wash uh, soap. It has wax in it, so if you get, you're kind of bound up, it'll make everything loose. <laughs> what the hell was that? Well, we're not taking the tire covers. They need to be. I took them off. Okay. So I mean. I know they have like a bunch of. And, yeah. and if you don't think this thing's going to get full of pollen in two weeks. Oh, I know it is, but at least it's better than it was. Look at all the soapses. There's so much soaps. Fatima, we have proof. Bruce said he didn't want no dirty campers in Vermont. Uh, are you recording him while he plays the trail? I'm doing a live no, stream. No, it's a live stream. Which, well, you just missed me being on the roof for half an hour. Oh, gosh. <laughs> so I figured Say hi, Susan. Hi. And then, <laughs> and then go like this. Hi, Francine. Hi, Francine. Hi, Francine. <laughs> cool, guys. Francine. Cool. Francine. Sonia's coming to ship and paint tonight. That's all Virginia. Very nice. Yeah, I know. Yeah, we talked to Virginia. And she did a good job. Yeah. On her painting? Yeah. Yeah, actually, that was actually pretty impressive. Very. Yep. Because so Sonia's painting may turn out to look like a landscape, but I don't know. <laughs>
Yeah, so you know, Bruce doesn't want any dirty campers in Vermont. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> it's just that Bruce is asking us if he told where he could go. <laughs> Tell him to get his butt down here and wash it himself. <laughs> of course, with him, he'd be as to a toothbrush. A toothbrush. <laughs> Right, Fatima? That's what I'm saying. He's welcome to wash it when we get there. <laughs> it's going to be dirty when we get there, right? I love you. I love you too. <laughs> I'm not complaining. <laughs> I know. I mean, I would like totally be there helping you, but. Actually, I was more concerned, really, about getting the gutters. Oh, yeah, I know. A lot of crap came off of there. Yeah. So when I get done on this side, we can let the awning all the way back out again. See, everybody's getting less of the kind of moving awning in and out. And then I want you to check the, uh, the LED lights. The LED lights where? LED lights where? LED lights underneath one Oh, okay. Because yeah, I know. Well, there's still stuff hung up in there. Where? Where the connection goes. No, no, no. By the, by the, see the end of the wire? What do you want me to do? Well, I'm going to go around and do the front and the other side. Okay. Okay, so you can let them, as soon as I clear here, I'm going to, you can let the morning out so that it dries. Yes, sir. Getting orders. Orders, I say, I'm getting orders. Oh, it looks definitely better on this side than it did before. It's white again, yay! Let's open the awning. Rob's never a wise ass. Never, ever, ever. Ta-da! Ta-da! You fell I can. I'm using.
Apparently, God forbid I walk around. I keep buffering. Excuse me, bug. <laughs> I'm back, and apparently I cannot walk around the camper without buffering. God forbid. Spray the tire covers down. See how clean they get. Oh, I guess I should check them, right? Good. That was a good idea. Hey, Sue. Yep, they're good. <sighs> uh, we're watching the camper, Sue. Jim was just on the roof for half an hour. Sue says hi. He can't hear you. On the other side of the trailer. Probably cursing you right about now. Let's see. Sue said hi. Hi. Can't believe to get my yola. Switzerland, you can come back with a box of yodels. <laughs> yodels. I'm not done yet. <laughs> What are you going to do? Oh, scrub the tire covers? Well, there you go. They were dirty birds, too.
Dirty board. They have the dirty board. I know, right? That's uh, Bruce and Lori's granddaughter. She's got a set of lungs on her. See, Mr. Clean to the rescue. Jim's legs are showing. Jim's legs are showing. Just like the day I bought him. Eight years ago. <laughs> oh, that's why Susan and Francine were walking by, because they saw your sexy legs. They're gorgeous, my love. Totally gorgeous. Yeah, I know, right, family? Jim wears shorts for the first time in, like, forever, and... Nobody can contain themselves. He usually wears them with boat shoes, but... What? No, that's right. The holes for the thing go on the bottom. You got it right. They're one size fits all double axle, so. 
That's why they're really big. Really? Come on, Bucky, with your stupid music. <laughs> yeah, the the left side has to go up more. I'm looking at the way you put the under there again, it just dry. Because I gotta get all muddy. So be flies coming out, let it dry out. Yeah, shut up. Don't do that to me. Potato, potato. This is my exciting day. Is it exciting? Exciting. Fatima's laughing. She's like, "He did. It's all half ass." Fatima, look. Tell me that ain't half ass. It's half ass. You know. Like, it's half ass. Really. Hi, love. Hi. <laughs> Why? Oh, jeez. He said, I swear to God, deep down inside, I swear to God, holy shit. <laughs> no, it's, it's just in the twisty underneath the water hose, that's all. No, it's wrapped around the electric box. Oh, well, how the heck did you do that? I, I didn't see that because the, the tree's in the way. Hey, Daryl, I sent you a picture of my breakfast for dinner last night. <laughs> Did I? I don't know. No. He said bite me. I sent it to you on Instagram. He's like, I'm not looking now. Fatima wanted to know what your reaction was, and I said you didn't answer it. I bet you he was barfing. No, he didn't even see it. He didn't look at it yet. Uh, he, said, he said it was blasphemy. Well, that's one way to do it. He's like, fine, I'll look. <laughs> he was editing a video.
okay, Daryl. It's not crazy. It's actually quite normal. No, he was washing the camper, Daryl. <laughs> I thought you were peeing. <laughs> But it's clean. He said nope. <laughs> he just messaged me back. He said nope. On the show bar rescue, the bar menu was entirely made of breakfast items for all shifts. He said, I can't. Why not? It's perfectly fine, though. Would it have been okay if we used Canadian bacon? Asking for a friend. This is yellow wood. He said nope. These yellow wood. Are yellow yellow ring box. Yellow wood. Leveling box. Homemade leveling box. Oh, Daryl doesn't eat bacon. Oh. How many Canadian is he? I bet she doesn't drink beer either. <laughs> it's because it's because he spent all that time in Los Angeles. He messed his Canadianism up forever. Micronized copper. Hazel. He said, "Ha ha, nope." Yeah. He doesn't. He doesn't like beer. Uh, Canadian Club. <laughs> Canada Dry Ginger Ale. Dry. <laughs> okay. Well, you know, yeah. what? at least there's a little bit in there. Oh, the breeze is nice. Did you put the warning back out? Yeah. Okay. Light works. This treated wood product is for ground contact and general use applications. Suitable uses include in ground contact within six inches of the ground and in or around fresh water. Well, there you go. Daryl, what are you saying? Watch the mud. If you say I missed the spot, I'm gonna go over there and just watch. <laughs> oh, I missed a big spot. You missed that whole spot right over. I'll be after this. Yeah, you had to see me on the roof. I had a dry spot to stand on going by. That's what he did. Let's see if my solar panels work any better. What he's saying? He's going to put 10% in my paycheck. <laughs> when you're in there, you didn't see any water in there where it didn't belong to you? No. Wait. Needless to say, I was a little nervous. Up there. I, I could see that. I didn't want to. I, I didn't, even if I felt on the trailer roof. Daryl said you missed a spot. Bite me, <laughs> eh? <laughs> there is a, a twig next to the window, but when it dries, it'll blow off. I'm sorry, I dropped the phone, Daryl. Jeez.
Then our neighbors aren't here today. Yeah, I know, right? I had a convenient place to put all the stuff in the pasture. And then I have to put it all back in. Uh -huh. <coughs> Daryl said, I'm not going to bite you because I said you were like old leather, so no thanks. Uh huh. <laughs> Weather. Exterior use including deck joists and beams that are difficult to maintain, repair or replace, and are critical to what? The Something and safety of the structure. Watched my golf cart yesterday, and Jordan and I went out in the woods and got a dirty side of the golf cart. Yeah. <laughs> you should have just waited until you got back. Well, you know, it makes, makes much sense. Um, it's supposed to be there now. I'm not cutting it. Here, Blake, Kim and, uh, and Dave didn't come down because I could use their tape. <laughs> Shaded spots, well, yeah, and, and I had to put some place to put all the stuff in the pasture to get the ladder out. It is a pretty yellow roof. No, Daryl. Uh, no it's our leveling that. board. Kind of need the handles. There. Just saying. Got to go on the bottom. You're very demanding this morning there, Mr. Daryl. What does he want now? He said the, the handle for the thing was in his way. What handle? Oh. The yellow rope. Oh. Just close one eye. See? It's right. a leveling board. Yeah. I'm showing him what the rope was for. Oh. So that I can pick up the wood without it get stuck to the ground and I'll move. Like those are going to be in two weeks. Yeah, see? There's two down there right now. There's two on the ground now, and then... It's not a swing. Dallas says you need help with your wood, Jim. Yeah, I think I do, actually. Truth be told. We'll find out when he's old someday. He's already old. He said I'm not offering. <laughs> well, at least there was a breeze. Yes. If it had been still, this job would have been miserable. Oh, it's not like it's humid. It's definitely... Well, the air conditioner is dripping. Yes. I know, because when I was getting everything out of the past, it was dripping. <laughs> it is nice, though. Daryl says, please smile, Jim. They couldn't even get me to smile for my picture in the program tomorrow. Why? Because when I smile, I look like a gremlin. No, you don't. Look like a gremlin. I look like a Tyler. It's still going to be 96. If it hasn't hit that already. I don't know. We have a weather station. Did you tell us what it is? Fatima says, nice work, Jim. Thank you, Fatima. Somebody appreciates it. But it's all done. It's keen. Keen, it's keen. See, he doesn't look like a gremlin, right? No, he doesn't. I can't, Daryl. I can't get my hand wet. Hello. 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 
the There's Mr. Sharpie. I, I think the last time I watched the trailer, she had some sort of similar excuse. No. You just started. And next thing you know, it was all you. I No, Daryl. I don't know. No, no, no. And of course, Bruce, poor school is, isn't even in here. <laughs> <laughs> He's at... No, this is Mr. Sharpie, Sue. That's the Dr. Drew, Dr. Mr. Sharpie on my finger. See? Mr. Sharpie. You, you did an awesome job, my love. You got a gold star. Thank you. That somehow makes me feel better. Who gave me a gold star? I did. Oh, you? Oh, well, that makes me feel a lot better. Yeah, he, that's Mr. Sharpie. The doctor put him there so he knew which finger to operate on. And then he decided to draw a bunch of dots on my hand and like he was making a map or something. I, I, I don't know. Just... Sue gave you five stars also. Uh, tell Bob, I don't care how much he has. I ain't cleaning that truck. <laughs> I don't care how much he has. I'm not cleaning the truck. Virtual car truck wash in that game. <laughs> I just like to see him play it once with everything turned on and see how he does. I know. That would mean he would have to follow road rules. Yeah, and he couldn't hit police cars. Right. All I could think of was that scene in Smokey and the Bandit this morning, Sue. So. When the, when the truck driver, when the Japanese truck driver takes the door off the police car. You did that on purpose, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I'm going to barbecue your ass in the glasses. I got the evidence. You can put the evidence. Get the evidence. Put the evidence in the car. Put the evidence in the car. <laughs> put the evidence in the back seat. <laughs> He does such a great B for T justice. There's no way, no way <laughs> that you could have come from my lawns. <laughs> Soon as we get home, I'm going to punch your mama right in the mouth. <laughs> he does such a great impersonation of him. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a Diablo sandwich and a Dr. Pepper and hurry up, I'm in the goddamn hurt. <laughs> what do you want, Junior? As a hush puppies, daddy, we ain't got time for, for that. <laughs> if Adam was off the couch. If <laughs> Adam <laughs> 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 fell off the couch. <laughs> I think I've seen that movie. <laughs> A few times. <laughs> oh god, you kill me. Well, I guess this stuff's not gonna put itself in there. No. Ah. <laughs> well now that everybody got their entertainment for the day. <laughs> Fatima is giving you an Oscar. <laughs> I want to thank all the little people I stepped on on my way up. <laughs> God. Uh. <laughs> I actually have to make a speech tomorrow. Yeah. 
I'll have Fatima I'll have him do it for you in person when we get the M22. <laughs> Today he's the king of the camper. Too funny. Hey, Bernie. All right, Fatima, we'll see you later on. The birds. What birds? Birds? Yeah, I know. They'll shit all over the camper because it's clean now. It's usually what happens. But, look, we cleaned the tire covers. They look like they're brand new. And I use this. So if you want some good cleaning stuff, they were dirty as hell. Mr. Clean, Clean Freak. There's some good stuff right there. Why do I need a nap? Driving me insane with this. These things are crooked. They're making me crazy. There we go. That's better. <clears throat> okay. That's a whole lot better. Thanks, so. Yeah, I was told by Bruce that we're not allowed to come to Vermont with a dirty camper. I guess it's in the laws up there, you know? But it needed anyway because it was like full of pollen and nasty, and you should have saw the stuff that came off the roof. So, yeah, you know. Thanks, Bernie. It's this man right here. It's all him. Hi. Excuse me, I'm replacing my divots. <laughs> replacing his, like you were playing golf or something. Oh. Well, it was in the pass through, wasn't it? It was in the pass through. Now I have to return. <laughs> We're not going to get into that story, Fatima. Carnival games at the rec hall. Oh.
and stuff. Thank you and stuff. You know, before you do that, what you got? Yeah, you could really be nice to me and bring me something cold and wet. A squatty pot. <laughs> <sighs> now I have to get him something to drink. Okay, I can do that. You know. Blue lights. Why are they still on? Turn off the blue lights. Bernie bought four of our friends pizza and beer if they would wash the rig. They did it faster than the pizza can bake. <laughs> yeah, that's the I did a video on these, Sue. Did you watch the video? I think she watched the video. And Fatima, look, I have campfire colors. I forgot about these. Alright, I have to get him a drink. I think he wants juice or lemonade or something. I'd give him water, but... Then my fidget data. Fidget data. I'm gonna give him orange juice. Orange juice. Orange juice. Am I messiness? Yep, we have to use them. No, that was a, that's, well, yeah, that's when I found out that the refrigerator was magnetic as well, but. Yep, got me some campfire colors. Orange juice. You're welcome, orange juice. Actually, the video I did for the LEDs was only like, what, 10 minutes? Something like that. They're great night lights. But that's all we got for now. Thanks for hanging out with all the funness and for your Beaufort T. Justice impersonation. Thank you, little lady. <laughs> and we'll see everybody later on. Bye.